Alright you guys, wanted to do a quick tutorial on getting a video from the internet into Keynote on the iPad for this project. I'll be using an app called Video Downloader. So the first thing I'll do is open the app and right here you can see I have my library of previously downloaded videos. In the bottom left I will open a browser and go to YouTube. When I'm in YouTube, I'll go ahead and search for uh, some videos. I'm going to go ahead and search for Mormon messages and then select one to download. You'll notice when I've selected it, before the video begins to play, this comes up and it gives me the option to download, which I will tap. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video so it doesn't play. It'll help the download speed just a little bit. Now what you'll notice on the bottom right is a little red badge. When you tap that, it'll give you the progress of your video download. Once the video is downloaded, on the bottom left I can select to go back into my media library. Find my video, there will be a couple of options. By selecting the three dots, I can save to camera roll. This is essential when uh, trying to get a video into Keynote. So I'll go, in, go into my camera roll, find the video that I've just downloaded. I'm going to go ahead and select it and put it into a folder so that it's easier to find from Keynote. I'll save mine into a seminary folder. I'll go ahead and get out of that and open up my Keynote. Go ahead and uh, open up a new format. You can pick whichever one you like of the options that are there. I'll go ahead and I'm going to use this in a minute. So I'm going to go and on the top right hit the plus button. And then on the very right of these four options is the media option. I can scroll all the way down, find the seminary folder, and then find my video. It'll compress it. I'll hit use and it drops it right into Keynote. Then I can adjust it how big I want it. I'm going to make it as big as I can, but I also want to have some text included. And so I will go ahead and write my question there that I want my students to consider as they watch the video. And then, if that's all I was doing, I would go ahead and hit the play button and the video will play. I believe that among the greatest lessons were learned. That's how you get a video from YouTube into Keynote.